Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me doing uh, day or week week five of the Decode Premium Daily Ch- or Weekly Challenge, uh, 348 Design Tic Tac Toe. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm. So I'm in a in a mountain house. It's kind of very cozy, very ch- nice, uh, very cute uh, here in Armenia, in diligence. But uh, yeah, anyway. Let's get to it. Uh, all right, let's see. Tic tac toe, end by end, okay. Do, 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 do. Horizontal, vertical, or diagonal wins the game, okay, fine. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look at the input. Basically, you're just trying to set it up, right? Um, I mean, a couple of ways you can emanate it. Uh, <clears throat> obviously. You don't want to do per move, uh, or I mean, you can. It doesn't matter. N is only small to check everything. Um, there are a couple of things you can do. Uh, yeah. Really. Uh, yeah. Let, let's set up the board real quick. So, do 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 do. Right. Mm, let's see. Rounded move. Okay. I just want to make sure that part about it. Um, let's say board is you go to. Um, let's just say zero times. N for da, 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 for every N, right? Uh, yeah. Oops. And basically, what we want to do is maybe cash roll, roll, uh, roll. Uh, is equal to da, 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 times N. Sorry, my enter key is sticky for some reason. So yeah, okay. Uh, do, 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 right. So the idea that I want to do is uh, something like this, right? Um, <clears throat> if one color or one player rather um, has all the moves on a row, a column, or the diagonals, that means that well, he or she put it in that um, that row or column or whatever n times, right? So we can definitely check it that way. So we'll do it that way. Is it one index or zero indexed? No, yeah, zero indexed, okay. Um, but basically here, isn't players always alternating? Should, right, but yeah, okay. But yeah, so self that board. I mean, I don't think, if everything is routed, we don't have to do any validation and stuff like this. So technically this may not even be needed, but you know, uh, but yeah. But basically what I want to do is uh, delta is equal to um, 1, maybe if player is equal to 2, delta is equal to negative 1, right? And then basically just do stuff that rows row. I hope this is right because actually I don't, I, I think it is, but you know. But the idea is that if this can only be, uh, uh, this can only be a winner if if uh yeah if this is you go to n or this is you go to n uh, i guess i should save down n and and also all the diagonals you go to n right so that's basically the idea Uh, what is the other one? Is it n minus co? Uh, I always don't know if it's off by one or not. Let's see. Uh, we'll see. Maybe it's just wrong, right? And then if sub dot rows of row is equal to a, sub dot n, and this has to be sub dot n, I say. Or sub dot rows. Uh, oh, or if the absolute value rather. And you can actually do this uh, a couple of ways, hmm. right? So maybe you can do something like, if you want to golf this a little bit, uh, like it, um, like best is to go to maybe max of the absolute value of self dot rows of row, self dot cows of cows, self dot uh, diagonals. Oh, wait, I think I, I confused them. Uh, 
Something like that, right? <clears throat> And then now, if best is to go to self n, uh, I don't know. I mean, this is still annoying to type. I'm just trying to not. Uh, then, then what happens? Uh, hmm. I'm trying to write as few as if statement as possible is what I'm trying to do, but. Uh, uh, but this is going to turn out to be like some weird, yucky looking code. Okay, so that means that if best is you go to um, but without the absolute value now. I guess I could have just written it that way, really, but eh, well, whatever. If this is equal to self.n, then what? Return 1, and then else returns uh, 2, right? Something like this. Oh, wait, did I miss the parents? I did. So that looks good. Let's give it some red. Yeah, uh, I don't know. The way that I wrote it is very weird. Maybe you should just use all more if statements. I was trying to like write as few if statements as possible is why. Uh, but I don't know that I did a good job to be honest. So yeah, uh, anyway, that's all I have with this one. That's all I have now. Let me know what you think. Stay good, stay healthy, to good mental health. I'll see y'all later, take care, bye-bye. Boop.